Now this catch, we're going to catch every ball we can with two hands, unless it's a throwing position. If it's a throwing situation, I give my guys the leeway to catch with one hand. I think it's just uncomfortable to take your take this hand in the glove when you're trying to make a throw. We're going to go ahead and catch this ball with one hand, but it's important that you get it across your chest quickly as you're starting your crow hop. So we're going to, to, to do the drill again. We're going to go ahead and start with our glove side foot forward. All I'm going to do is I'm going to throw a ball right in their glove, and as they're pulling it across their chest quickly, they're going to start their crow hop and get in thrown position. Glove side shoulder, crow hop. Glove side shoulder, crow hop. You'll notice that the guys who are catching the ball with two hands right now are freshmen that hadn't been here a while. One hand, get it across your chest quickly. One hand, get it across your chest. Now, every ball we catch in the outfield, uh, in inter-squad games and any type of games, our outfielders, unless they have to reach for a ball, if they have to reach outside the scope of their body, we're going to catch every ball with two hands. And I implore all you young kids, don't catch fly balls with one hand, because inevitably, over the course of your career, you're going to misjudge one to the point where it may roll out. Catch every ball you can with two hands.